crowd is only given the fact that Punk Brian was interrupted by two commercial breaks. It seems for a moment that tag defeaters at Vision would no longer be trapped in bookie purgatory and may actually add value to the Mania card. That is until the entertainment event that is Kane showed up and choke slam members of all three teams to hell. Yeah. And why was this done? Was there any tension between Kane and any members of the Vision <laughs> to set up? No. Was this done to set up a hilariously mismatched Kane tag team reunion with the returning RBD of the Hurricane from again? It was because WWE wanted to remind us that Kane exists and is a monster. Yeah. That's it. Yes. You got him. Thank but then he said, thank you WWE for working, keep us with work, you almost turned the tag titles into antiques. Now that would be they, worth they, something. They can do both. And, and antiques implies they're worth something. So no. <laughs> That's true. And they did both. I thought that this... I thought the tag match actually built up a possible uh, tag match between some combination of these three teams at WrestleMania and also made Kane look, remind us that Kane exists and is a threat to someone. I, I don't know why it can't do both. Can it do both? Yeah, yeah I, don't, I don't know why you're so uh, angry against the football orthodox. There you go. I got one from Butch 3D. Hi guys, it's Butch 3D. Last night's Rock Cena segment were on 9 to me or something. Back at Over the Edge 1999, a show many people haven't seen for obvious reasons. 